against my might! Please let Lord Sauron know, too. Sir! You seem to be in quite the rush. What happened? The reinforcements have managed to solidify the castle's defenses. Now I can lead the charge against the enemy! against my might! Witness my might! For the sake of Ur and Master Jogu, I must unleash all of my rage on the fields of Jing province. Hmm. Things do look bad. I will not retreat. We must stop the enemy here! Even at the cost of our lives! We cannot afford to lose this position! I shall personally see to its defense! Let's go capture one of those unsightly positions! Follow me! Stronger! Nothing can stand against my might!
Our target has been determined. Jing province is essential to our plan to divide the land in two. But we cannot fall back now! I'm here with you, Zhou Yu. Go forth and unleash your passionate spirit on the battlefield. That base will weaken the enemy greatly. All units, march! to lose this position. I shall personally see to its defense. My might is without equal! You've proven to be a very talented fighter. Expect nothing less from the great Zhang Liao. Your skills are as sharp as ever, I see. Capturing that base will weaken the enemy greatly. All units, march! <laughs> I shall pull back for now. But next time, I will not fall so easily. Every victory serves to make me that much stronger. Capturing that base will weaken the enemy greatly. All units, march! My might is without equal! We shall defend this position. Do not allow a single enemy through. Greatly. All units, march! <laughs> 
serves to make me that much stronger! You have proven to be a very talented fighter. less from the great Zhang Liao. Your skills are as sharp as ever, I see. All right. I need everyone to defend this area. to make me that much stronger! I can't hold out any longer. Do you? Please, forgive my failure. Might is without equal! You've proven to be a very talented fighter. You're a true warrior of the Three Kingdoms. Time to finish this! Alright. I need everyone to defend this area. How were they able to overcome our momentum? I must withdraw for now so I can think up a new plan. to drive them back. What is our next move, Shun Yu? I think that we should wait for a while. We should be receiving news from the West. We've managed to push back the Wu army to the other side of the Xiongjiang. However, they'll be back once they can get more troops. We're not out of the woods yet. We have just received a report from our scouts. They have spotted an army marching on us from the west. It is being led by Guan Yu. Yuck! Of all the times for Guan Yu to show up. 
Our forces have been pushed to the brink of exhaustion. It will be difficult to fight another battle. We should hole up in the castle and call for reinforcements. No. Holding up in the castle will not enable us to overcome the current situation. If we remain in Xiongling, we will eventually have to hold off a pincer attack from both Liu Bei and Sun Chuen. With a new enemy to the west, that is impossible. In that case, what should we do? We cannot just sit back and let them take Xiongling. No, we should allow Guan Yu to take Xiongling. If we do, there is a chance that it could lead to friction in the alliance between Liu Bei and Sun Chuen. What? Is such a thing even possible? This whole plan is going much too fast for me. Since the Battle of Shibi, Liu Bei strategist Zhuge Liang has been putting him in a position to eventually face Sun Chuen in battle. Therefore, they are certain to want Jing province as a foothold towards the Central Plains. I cannot imagine that Zhuge Liang would ever give Zhongling to Sun Chuen. So, you want to use our current predicament to our advantage and break up the Sun Liao Alliance? Impressive as always, Master Shun Un. Okay, let's move to enact Shun Yo's plan. Withdraw the army to Xiongyang and Xin Ye. If Liu Bei and Sun Xuan's alliance continues to hold up, it will put Master Cao Cao's plans in danger. However, this plot can enable us to avoid that. It is exactly what we need given the situation. Now, let us return to Xu Chong. There is one more thing I must attend to. We worked hard to defend this land, and to now turn it over to the enemy? I know this is all part of our plan, but it hurts all the same. Sao Sho, you are right to feel that way. Yet, that is also the reason that Sun Xuan and they will not think that we abandoned Jiang Ling on purpose. Shun Er's plot might just serve as the basis for our future endeavors. Hmm? I thought I heard something. My lord! Watch out! Cao Cao! Dragon who seeks the throne! Your selfish arrogance ends here! So, you're Montaing of Leon Province. I never expected you to launch an attack on Xu Chang. Side of this conflict shall pay by my sword of righteousness. Witness my fight. I'm sorry, Father. Let's go. The enemy does not stand a chance against our might. Let's 
go. The enemy does not stand a chance against our might. My might is without equal. Let's go. The enemy does not stand a chance against our might. Pleasure to meet you. Oops. Looks like I messed up. But I think discretion is the better part of valor. We can't defeat Salto. Maybe not. But we aren't going to give up either. Every victory serves to make me that much stronger. Very good. I shall remember your end. Time to finish this. Chase him down. Let him go. Ma Tang will learn that his assassination attempt failed soon enough. They'll likely follow up by sending an army from Liang province. Ma Tang's son is the renowned warrior Ma Chao. We must prepare our army and head to Luo Yang. Yes, my lord. I shall see to it at once. It appears Ma Chao and his forces are on the attack. What is the situation like, Wan Yi? Ma Chao, Han Sui, and some others have taken up position at Tong Gate. We attacked them head-on, but were forced to retreat. Currently, we are bolstering our defenses at Luoyang and Pubanjin. I must apologize for failing to hold off Ma Chao. No, I ought to be the one apologizing to you for being so late with the reinforcements. 
I know why you were unable to come, General. It is not your fault. You ensured that we received the necessary supplies, Master Shaho Yuan. I must thank you. Ah, stop. You're making me blush. We'll take care of Ma Chao. So sit back, get some rest, you hear? I cannot do that. Now that I am relieved of defending Luo Yang, this is my chance to claim Ma Chao's head at last. I see. If that's how you feel, then I suppose it's all right. We are facing a mighty coalition. It would be best if we could somehow drive a wedge between them to weaken their forces. The morale of the troops in front of us is unbelievably high. It will be quite difficult to push them back. How about the north side of Tongate? If we could cross the Yellow River, we could strike the enemy from behind. So, we can attack head-on, or cross the river and strike from behind. Either way, it will likely prove to be a difficult battle. However, with Liu Bei currently in Shu, and Sun Xuan in Wu, we must deal with any potential threats before they become a problem. Ma Chao and his followers may have momentum on their side, but we will emerge victorious. Master Joshu seems to have a plan. It may help us get through our current predicament. All right. I have a brilliant plan, but nobody to execute it. It would be nice if we could get some help here. <laughs> Thank you. Now, let's get to it. I simply need you to deliver this letter to Han Sui. He will know what to do. Now then, it's time to get going. If this goes as planned, the battle will quickly turn in our favor. Traded the enemy camp all alone. But it seems you have little intention of fighting. Oh, I see. You're here as a messenger. What's that? You have something to give me. What is it? Oh, I see. Master Cao Cao is an old acquaintance of mine. I promise to read this letter. Your letter has been safely delivered. You may consider your duty as a messenger done. to hurry and report this to Lord Ma Chao. Report! Lord Han Sui appears to have made contact with the rear officer! Surely he hasn't betrayed us. 
dangerous to leave Master Han Sui at Hangu Gate. Send a message to Master Han Sui. Tell him he is to move at once to defend the rear of Tong Gate. Lord Han Sui, a message from Lord Ma Chao. He needs you back at Tong Gate. My might is without equal! We are to retreat? They must suspect me of treason because I was seen talking with that messenger from Wei. I hope my child will be prepared to listen to my explanation. But if not, you will have to consider the option of defecting to Wei. We're advancing. Everyone follow my lead. Nothing can stand against my might! If we can breach here, it'll be a straight path to the way main camp. Here goes nothing! Time to finish this, you! How dare you launch a sneak attack on us like that! Don't think we'll go down without a fight! Witness my fight! That area shall be ours. Claim it at once. That didn't go so well. Sorry about that, young master. Stand against my might! You know, you actually possess a modicum of talent. Simply magnificent! <laughs> this place in the name of my lord
figured Wei might bypass the Yellow River and come this way instead. I must defend Tong's gate's backside from attack. I can tell that you are no ordinary officer. However, it would not change the outcome of this encounter. Hold to the advance. We shall take up a defensive position here. Let us go and capture that area. We shall make it a thing of beauty. You shine with the beauty that only a true warrior of the Three Kingdoms can possess. are simply magnificent! We will seize that area over there. Everyone, follow me! Time to finish this! serves to make me that much stronger! I failed my duty. Forgive me, Master Machao. I have no excuse. Lord Machao, they are planning to cross the river and attack our rear. No way! There's nowhere for us to run now! Hmm. The soldiers are frightened. But I will never bow before Cao Cao. Stronger! Thing! 
stand against my might! Ha! <laughs> 